Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome to Strand Deep. This is our second take, our second season of Strand Deep. They've added a few more things to the game, and oh my, does it look as good as ever. Like, people give this game a lot of crap, but I really like it. Like, this is one of a kind of a game, and I'm gonna keep playing it, even though it's dead. Oh my god, did we get lucky with this island? Look how many shipwrecks. We got like, what, one, two, three, uh, four, well, I'd, I'd say three and a half, four, five, so another one, six, seven, mm, add another half. So we got around like eight, eight shipwrecks. And we may even have more on that side of the island. This is crazy. We've got so lucky in the sun. Basically, I'm just going to go through all these objectives on the top left. And I'm going to try to camp a little... Sorry, we're going to try to craft a little, little base station here for our operations across the Pacific until we can find a way to uh, get off this ranched place. Because if we do not, we will die. So let's just go around and collect a few resources, a, um, i.e. rocks, sticks. I don't think we can lay our hands to, really. Let's see what we can craft. Stone tool, thank you very much. We want a knife. Let me do that. Cue that up. We need lashing. So make another stone tool. And then we go find the yucca plant. A yucca. A yucca plant. To um get some lashing from, which is basically the main priority of this game. If you have lots of lucky cheese, you're all set to go. Oh my, this is like a really nice island. I'm I'm really liking this. I'm not gonna lie. This is my third attempt to try and make the second season. The first attempt, um, I made some poor, poor choices. What's this? Is that? Oh! Are you kidding? I'm poisoned already. I haven't seen any sharks. So hopefully we're in the clear, but this is pretty deep war, you know, guys? But the time I come back out here, there'll be a shark as well. Oh, jeez! <gasps> yeah, this is a shark! I saw that guy. <sighs> Oh, look at Ow! That guy seriously just poked me? And it didn't really work out too well in my favor, especially because I didn't build a shelter. Alright, try to try make it to that boat there. I think I can do it. But I think the shark was over there. I guess we can go to that. Let's go check out that place and see if there's no sharks. Okay, I'm just expecting to see it come out of the blue any moment now. Okay, let's quickly hop on this. Oh my gosh, it's right there. I see it. Oh, okay, I think we're stranded out here, guys. You guys see it? I don't see it. Truly hasn't left me alone already. Try to just jump in. Oh, I see it. It's right there. Oh, it's so eerie. It's going pretty fast as well. Or maybe we should just dive in. Oh, it went for a swing there. Yeah, that's it. I see, buddy. I see. There you are. Look at the tire shot to me. Yes. Oh god. Oh god. Where is it? I don't see it. You hear it? Stay away! Where's the land? <laughs> that was the worst idea I've ever had. It was absolutely dreadful. So, I lost all my progress when I died. <laughs> okay, guys. We'll have to do it. <laughs> We're going to make the Jurassic measure. I'm going on to another island. What the hell is that? Are you friendly? Giant crab. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. I'm sorry. 
What's that? What's it doing? I don't see any yucca plants. Any plants. Oh, oh god, what was that? Was that? Giant hog, what the hell? You know what? I have a good idea. Oh, that's not such a good idea. So that was not handy whatsoever. But we will not make that mistake this time. And in my second try in making the second season, Oh, what did I collect? Oh, yucca fruit. This will be very useful in creating my little farm for yucca trees. But anyway, as I was saying before, in my second attempt in trying making this season, I actually forgot to press the record button, even though how ridiculous that sounds. I actually did that and I saw my progress again. But well, I've like quadruple checked. I've um, pressed the record button this time and we should be all set to go. Okay. So do we only have these two yucca plants on this island? But we do have a lot of rock nodes, which I haven't seen in the game before. Because I didn't have them in the first season. But I'm guessing we can get like, rocks out of them. And we've got quite a few of those, so... I think that can be quite handy if we can... Somehow... Exploit them or something. Anyway, I think that's all the... Yucca plants on this island, so we're gonna try craft ourselves some lashing so we can craft... Ourselves a knife, because that's how this game works. Everything's um, evolved around the lashings. It's the main currency, basically. Let's make ourselves a fine knife. Yes, please. Kill a crab. Oh, poor crab. Let's find that one we saw in the intro. I swear he was going to attack me at any second. He kept coming closer and closer as a little crab walk. We won't have none out in the sun. Here. There you go. Alright, bring you over here. Here. <laughs> I don't understand, so how can you skin the crab? I guess you can like take it out of its shell, but I won't be caught skinning it. it. Doesn't really have skins, it's a crustacean. Just silly, you know? Just little silly stuff. Wow, we've really lost a lot of um, SPF. I don't know what that stands for, but I know it's like how burnt you get. And we don't want skin cancer out here. But basically, in this game, once you put the full, it just never goes back down. And the best way to pull it to full is by swimming pretty deep in the ocean as shadows don't really work too well, even though they're supposed to, I think. Since we're swimming, we may as well go check out the shipwreck. I'm just really scared of a shark. Since I got my music turned off, I don't know if there's a shark coming. And oh, look at this turtle. That's so cute. I'm gonna pet one. All right, but none of that. Go that. Turtles be wild, be free. Oh, Jesus. What the hell did I just touch? I'm oh, great, I'm poisoned. It's a great start. What did I touch? Anyway, um, stay away from wherever this stuff is. I'm just gonna stay away from all coal. Yeah, whatsoever, because it seems a very bad idea to be touching around piece of coil. Coil? Coil? Coal. Oh yeah, two shipwrecks. Nice. Let's try to get into this bigger one first. We have to get rid of this poison effect, because it's gonna slowly drain our health, I believe. Can't get into that way. How lovely. Let's go through this way. Also, there's a sprint bar now, and I'm guessing it drains away my food and water qu more quickly, so I'm gonna try not to use it that much. Can I break these spells with my knife? Oh yeah, I can. Nice. Now we've got bow scrap. Can I collect it? Nope. I can drag it back to the island, probably. Most likely. Oh yeah, I found the entrance to this middle cabin. Okay, let's see if there's anything of use in here. Oh my god, okay. There's literally nothing of use. Okay, this is just fantastic. What great shipwreck. We got so fortunate with the number of shipwrecks and they're just not worth it whatsoever. Imagine being able to build like a motor raft immediately from the get-go, from the first island, just because of all these shipwrecks here. That'd be nuts. Ooh, a lantern. The last one, that's so good. We don't really need a compass, we got one, but I guess it's good. Oh, and the electrical part. Oh, lashings. I love lashings. Uh, what's in this one? Metal. Okay, that's pretty good. And we'll bring this wood container back. So that would be quite useful. Just store all our belongings in. Um, I'm just checking for sharks at the moment because normally one spawns with you on the first island. But it seems I'm fortunate enough not to have it just yet. So, um,. I'm just gonna jump in the water here. No shock to see. 
every time like I push wall past my like, person, it sounds like something's like swimming past me, so I'm like freaking out as a shark, but then it's not, it's all good. Oh, what's in this one? Oh, fishing spear and more electrical parts. Yeah, it wouldn't be so rich in the electrical parts and everything, mold vice and stuff. And I believe you can craft gyrocopters now, which I gotta say, is pretty darn awesome. When you're flying around, you like different islands and stuff. That's so sick. So I'm drop this here. Very nice. And we want to basically want to heal up our poisons as best as possible, but we need to be level three in crafting for that. And we need the peppy peppy plant, which looks like this kind of, but in a smaller group. I'm pretty sure I saw one on the island somewhere. So I won't be too worried getting to it, but we just have to level up fast enough to get there. Also, we probably should make a campfire to cook our um, meat. I the crab meat. Very more specific. I don't want to be cooking our own meat. That would be very painful. Well these sticks. Need sticks. Sticks. That doesn't matter too much. And if I chop down one of these um figus trees, it'll give me sticks. Oh jeez. The shadow moves so much when I do it. Oh nice four sticks, that's so good. And I leveled up in harvesting, that's awesome. And what harvesting does, maybe it gives you more materials once you harvest stuff, which I think is pretty useful, especially if we're gathering rations, because, oof, I mean five cents, because we need a lot of those to make rations. Okay, let's mark, mark, mark ourselves a campfire, and we'll just place it in this little hillside here. It's quite cute. Now we craft ourselves some kindling. Dun -dun -dun. Place that down there. This is apparently invincible. Whoa, that's so right. Okay, we're gonna turn you off. <laughs> um, we don't need a compass, so we're gonna put that into our raft because our raft also has a compass, which you don't really need at the moment. Food and water is going pretty fine and dandy at the moment. Don't need a leather, it's for later game stuff. Um, crude spear. That's pretty cool and all, but we don't really need that either. Yeah, unless we're dealing with wild balls or something. So like, I got killed last time, but we're not going to speak of that. Um, another crude spear? I thought I had a fishing spear. Hmm. Okay, we've got two crude spears. Oh, I just crafted that, didn't I? Damn it. I didn't actually have it. Okay, that's a bit of a waste. Lashings. We attach this to the, oh, attach this to the campfire. Well, we just check this other crab meat into here for later time to, I don't know, cook it up. Let's go bring this closer so it doesn't get dragged away by the tide. <laughs> so that would be very unfortunate. It says it wants us to light this. And I love this mechanic. So to light up stuff, you have to um, fill up this bar at the bottom. You have to use the left and right to mass buttons to do that by scanning them, which I think is pretty cool. Ooh, an upgrade physical. That's cool. And the microwave will go bing when the crab meets away to be harvested. Harvested. Collected. Pick up a coconut. Okay, yeah. I think that's a great idea before we get too thirsty. And to go around and collect all the coconuts. In my second one through the um, making the second season, I actually fell off one of these coconut trees and broke my legs. So I was wobbling around. Wobbling? Yeah. Is that right? And I'm wobbling around like a small little hobbit man for like 30 minutes until I can make myself a splint. It's just awful, awful way to start my game. Yeah, let's just go down and collect as many coconuts as we can before it gets dark. Once it does get dark, let's head back to our little little campfire and we'll turn on our lantern and see how well that works at night time. That'd be quite fascinating. Look how nice that is. That is such a good such a good view. Oh, that's too tall, too tall. Uh, that was good. We like how I can climb trees like this. This is so cool. I wish, um, like... Oh. 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 Yeah. I wish, like, uh, FPS games could do this as well. <laughs> that would be pretty sweet. Oh, my lantern turned on. <laughs> that's really nice. Alright. Because coconuts are spherical, they kind of, like, roll around. And because I'm on a hill, it's not very good place for them, so I'm going to put them in this little safety basket, aka the raft, survival raft to be more precise. Um, we'll just do that a few times. There you go. 
We have quite a few coconuts. This should last us a little bit. Make sure we make ourselves a little wall still, so we can collect some more. Okay, and this last one, we're gonna crack open. Bam. I think I missed it. No, I didn't. Bam, okay. Now we have a drinkable coconut. Drink that with some precious water. Didn't give us much though. And then we can hit it a few more times. I think four. Yeah, four. And we get coconut halves, which actually give us food. Yeah, they both give us like a half. Which is pretty alright for coconut. So like one coconut gives like one full thing of um, food. It's pretty nice. Cook some more crab meat. Alright. And let's get our other crab meat while we're at it and put that on too. Yeah, there you go. And we attach that to the campfire. And we don't really need to eat this yet, so we just hold on to it. It's not going to go well in the inventory because they haven't added that to the game, so I don't have to worry about that. And now I want us to craft an axe. So we're going to chop down palm trees. And we need... First we need stone tool. And then... It wants us to get another stick. Oh, that's a cool spear. I don't want that. Put that over there. Put that. Don't want that. Ew. Um... Cruise fish used to be super useful in like gathering fishes. Fish? Fishes? No. Fish. Fish from the ocean. But um, now fishing speeds do that for you and yet you can't do it with a normal cruise spear. So the only use is to like fire off animals on land and we don't have any on the starting island. So no need to worry about it just yet. Ooh, I have a brilliant idea. Let's take the lantern with us so we can search the island for sticks. Can we like hold it and the light will be on? Or do you have to like right click and drag it around? Oh yeah, we can hold it. That's so good. Okay, let's go find ourselves a stick. Hee hee hee. Mission accomplished. Let's drop that here. We can craft ourselves an axe. Very nice. And now let's... Ooh, bats. Ooh, it's quite a few. Let's go find ourselves a tree. Trying to be chopped down. Uh, yeah, let's do this one. Oh, and I missed my first hit. How marvelous. Straight back to base camp, and we'll chop up even further. And we leveled up again in harvesting. Damn, it's really easy to level up in harvesting. We're gonna be full harvesting people soon. Very easy. Okay, I think that should be enough to make ourselves a shelter. And it sure is. So let's just place one here. And let's just uh, save. And I'll see the rest of you in the morning.